Okay, we're we're, gonna, um, we're about to begin here the uh, um, the upgrade. Um, where, is, where is Abel? I, I have a hard time pronouncing it. I like how you use it. Hey, well, if you want to um, come to the mic and do a little bit of 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 a little Basically, we're switching it up a little bit, so we're going to do the implant first, then I'm going to speak. So if there's a mask next to this afterward, I won't be truly intended. Um, so essentially what is going on here um, is Philip's going to get an EM4102 uh, read-only tag. Uh, the tag just has uh, 60 bits, 40 bits of which are data, so that's about 10 characters um, of a unique ID. Sure. What is the expertise? Um, this is Virginia Stevens, and she runs uh, kind of like runs over uh, Hypatia Medical Clinic in Um She's like the I don't know what are you the owner operator oh, chief yeah, chief boss. Yes. Um, so she did my left hand uh, with the EM four one two. She used a scalpel and stuff. My slightly more. Is she like a veterinarian? Or? Oh, <laughs> 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 medical doctor background. Um, <laughs> Uh, who's next to line? <laughs> uh, register with her, and she'll take care of you. What does uh, like the FDA think about this kind of thing? Uh, well, the FDA doesn't uh, approve, you know, generally these particular chips. Um, they've used, been used in animals and whatnot for years. Uh, Verichip is the only company that currently has an FDA-approved implantable RFID chip, but uh, for very uh, lots of lots of reasons, uh, it's not popular in the do-it-yourself community. I'll talk about that. <laughs> I don't know, can you update it while it's inside, or do you have to take it out to update it? Well, I mean, the, the updatability of the chip is, it means you can't. It's read-only, so it's like laser set in the factory with this unique ID. Um, like me, for instance, I have two. I have one in my right hand as well. Uh, the right hand is a Philips high tag, which has a unique ID, but also has crypto security features, as well as a uh, you know 2,048 bits of 255 bytes, approximately, of a... Uh, um, Data rewrite storage, so I get my right data to it, read it off later, and change it. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, that's fine. Um, no more implants for me. I'm done. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Being done with uh, an avid PET injector kit. Um, the, the avid chip is inside the needle and it's being, you know, it's not being used because they're proprietary and computer hardware for this. So, one the person down actually here. did, uh, who, who was uh, interested in this, uh, they Hold did on one get a chip implanted that was the avid friend chip. They got implanted in their shoulder uh, before they really did any research and then they found out they couldn't use it anywhere. So, and also, um, a little bit of information about chips. The, uh, the added chip also has a coating on it which allows your flesh to grow into it a little bit to stop uh, migration. Um, so removal and or replacement is very difficult. Um, these chips don't have that coating and that's kind of been like a precursor for the DIY community. What's the number on the chip? What's it for? Uh, the number on the chip <laughs> is uh, unknown at this time. You'll have to read it. Um, and uh, they'll have to tell you about what it's going to actually use. It's a numbing action in there. Are there any uh, problems with migration at this kind of application? Well, um, some of the chips actually that are implanted deeply in the flesh, like in the um, muscle tissue, there is migration issue because they're kind of flex and kind of wants to move around a little bit. But uh, this being just under the dermis, it's, it's not really an issue. I haven't had issues. Other people haven't had issues. Uh, maybe if I you know, was 100 years old, with the elasticity uh, was lost in the skin, then it might have been an issue. Have you noticed you're getting in the way of any kind of activity? Uh, no, not at all. 
Like really super popular. 